All hands, full stop. Hostiles detected at the landing coordinates. Joker, what have you got? Sensors show a Reaper parked at the Shroud facility. No way you're gonna be able to land a shuttle there. Get everyone assembled in the war room. I want eyes on the Shroud. Aye, aye, ma'am. New form of Reaper, Shepard. Using Shroud to poison Tuchanka's atmosphere. Problematic. They wanna fight! They just got one. Primark, we're gonna need your help. That could be difficult. Our losses on Palavin have been catastrophic. You said you'd help. It's time to deliver. What is it you need? A combined attack. Your people hit the Reaper with an airstrike. Rex, at the same time, your soldiers will be attacking from the ground. Together, you can draw it away from the tower. Yes, distraction. Small team can reach Shroud facility. Finish synthesizing cure. We'll need Eve to come with us. Then it's now or never. Now. The Genophage ends today. Commander, incoming message marked urgent. I'll put it in the comm room for you. Dalatrast. Commander Shepard, we know you've reached Tuchanka. And by now, I imagine Morden Solus has proposed using the Shroud. You spying on us? Hardly. The Shroud is the only viable course of action open to you. Commander, you can't allow the diplomatic pressures of this war to cloud your judgment. Do you honestly believe curing the genophage will end in lasting peace? No, I don't. The Krogan are too violent, but I don't have a choice here. Then allow me to offer you one. Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you were planning couldn't be done. Morden will likely detect this malfunction and repair it. But if you ensure that he doesn't, then the cure's viability will be altered just enough so that it fails. No one will notice the change. You mean trick the Krogan? They need not be any the wiser. Let Erdnot Rex believe you fulfilled your promise. Morden would never stand for that. How you deal with him is up to you, Commander. We can provide you our very best scientists to build the Crucible, and the full support of our fleets. If I sabotage the cure. Think about it, Commander. The choice is yours. I've ordered the clans to assemble at the Hollow. It's our sacred meeting ground. We'll land there and take an armored convoy against the Reaper. This will be the defining moment of Krogan history. Krogan history filled with defining moments, most bloody. Hope this one better. Commander, you seem troubled. There's just a lot on the line. I want this to go well. Have faith. No matter the adversity we face, some moments are destined to happen. This is one of them. Rex, it's Reef. The Reapers are already at the hollows. Come out with guns blazing. Hang on tight. We're heading in. Blood has finally soaked our soil. 
We have to get to the Shroud. The airstrike is on its way. Female safe, Shepard. Vitals are strong. What's a Salarian doing here? Nobody said anything about this. Multiple Krogan. Problematic. Who are you? Erdnot Reed, brood brother to our illustrious leader. <laughs> Reeve and I share the same mother, and nothing else. For which I'm thankful. I remember what it means to be a true Krogan. <laughs> we flay our enemies alive and drown them in a geyser of their own blood. We don't invite them into our home. There's no time for this. Whatever grudge you have against Salarians ends right now. As long as it involves a bullet in his head, time for some payback. Oh, ah! Stand down, Reeve. The Solarian is with me. <laughs> the enemy you were born to destroy and win a new future for our children i choose to fight who will join me i don't want to regret curing the genophage do you want this or not i do what about the rest of you <laughs> future to look forward to. Until Salarian interference? No. We destroyed Tachunga ourselves. Technology changed us. It made life too easy. So we looked for new challenges and found them in each other. Nuclear war was inevitable. But now our planet is rubble. We'll need a better place to live. Any hint of the Krogan trying to expand again could raise alarms. My children aren't going to suffocate in this cesspool. I want them to witness a new age. A Krogan Empire. Rex. I'm not saying we won't ask first, but the Council can't expect us to stay here forever. There's that look in your eye again, Commander. What's troubling you? Just thinking about Earth. Your courage for my people will be remembered. You won't be alone in your fight. Why are we stopping? Stay with Eve. It's looking ugly out here. Turian 
wing Artemek. This is Shepard. We've been delayed. Hold off your attack. Negative, Commander. Our approach is locked. We made it back outside. Well, if you can see sunlight, that's progress. And the color green. I thought plants were extinct around here. You're looking at hope. All that's left of it on Tachanka. This is once a world full of beauty. Given a chance, it can be again. Shepard, that Reaper is still up to no good at the Shroud. Find a way out of there and we'll pick you up. We're on it. Dealing with the Reaper when we get there will be another matter.
What's happening? Some crazy idea we can talk about later. Just worry about getting out of there right now. Looks like another shooting gallery. Before. But 
getting to that tower. I don't know. We're curing the genophage no matter what it takes. Everything my people will ever be depends on it. And I hope this idea you were talking about is a good one. It was hers, actually. Cow was. We summon her to the Reaper. Would that even work? Already discussed strategy. Just need to distract Reaper. Draw it from tower while cure synthesized. Released. What makes you so sure she'll come? Legends say she is the mother from which all other Thresher Maws spawn. This is as much her home as ours. If Tuchanka has a temper, Kalros is it. Nobody's ever faced her and survived. We flew through the Omega-4 relay and survived. We can do this. That's the spirit, Shepard. How would we summon her? The tower was built in an arena devoted to Kalros's glory. The Salarians thought she would scare away in truth. Appears to have worked. There are two Maw Hammers there, the largest in existence. If you can activate them, Kalros will come. That should distract the Reaper. Meanwhile, laboratory nearby. We'll finish synthesizing you. We know why we're here and what's at stake. So let's make it happen. Wait! I want you to know that no matter what happens, you've been a champion to the Krogan people, a friend of Clan Erdnot, and a sister to me. To every Krogan born after this day, the name Shepard will mean hero! Now, let's show them why! Go! I've got this! I am Erdnot Rex, and this is my planet! See you on the other side. Stay alive, Shepard. We'll have cure ready.
Morton, is secure ready? Yes, loaded for dispersal in two minutes. Procedure traumatic for but not lethal. Malin's research invaluable. She's okay? Headed to safety now. Her survival fortunate. We'll stabilize new government should Rex get any ideas. Good match. Promising future for Grogan. Damn! Control room atop of Shroud Tower. Must take elevator up. You're going up there? Yes. Readings at last suggest temperature malfunction. Could affect cure viability. Need to adjust settings manually. It's too dangerous, Morton. We need to get out of here. No. Temperature variants could destroy cure. Time running out. Have to go up. Morton! You're not going up. Not concerned for my safety. Concerned I might discover something. Sabotage? But whose? Ah. Why, Shepard? That desperate for Salarian aid? Or that afraid of Krogan? Every time we've talked about this before, you've defended the Genophage. Hell, I had to talk you into saving Malin's data. How can you change your mind now? I made a mistake! I made a mistake. Focused on big picture. Big picture made of little pictures. Too many variables. Can't hide behind statistics. Can't ignore new data. My responsibility. Need to go. Running out of time. Morden, walk away. Can't do that, Shepard. I don't have a choice here. Walk away or I will fire. Not your decision. Not your work. Not your cure. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. No time to argue. Cure dispersal imminent. Must counteract sabotage. Stop me if you must. No. Not... Not ready. Long time ago, my father betrayed me in this place. His own son. He tried to kill me, so I had to kill him. Right over there. That's what the Genophage reduced us to. Animals. But you changed that today, Shepard. Now we'll fight for our children, not against them. It's just a pity Morden had to die. You mean, upon the tower? 
Yes, that was the courage of the highest order, sacrificing himself so our children may live. A thousand years from now, we'll probably be singing songs about him. <laughs> ah. But you, Commander, we can thank you in person. Tell the Turians I'll be deploying troops to Palavan immediately. And when you're ready to kick the Reapers off Earth, you let me know. The Krogan are back in business. Goodbye, Commander. What will you do now? Spread the hope you've given us. Even now, there are clans gathering in the Kelphic Valley. I'll go speak to them and make sure this gift isn't squandered. Thank you for all that you've done. And know that Erdnot Bakara calls you a friend. troops to Palavan. You kept your end of the bargain, and now I'll keep mine. The Turian hierarchy will stand with humanity against the Reapers. We're going to need you. Don't forget where we live. Never. It's clear we all fight together, or die. To that end, several dry dock ships are ready to help build the Crucible. Garrus will coordinate them. Yes, sir. And when the time comes to deploy it, the full measure of our fleet will be there for Earth. May the spirits watch over us all. I'll start managing Turian support right away, Shepard. You must be exhausted. Morden dying... it can't be easy. I'll sleep when I'm dead. We both know you need a clear head to win a war. There's no room for mistakes here. You should catch some shut eye. I'll make sure Joker doesn't launch any suicide missions. Anything happens, you let me know. Open. Shepard, there's something you need to hear. All right. 
Is this a bad time? Thinking of some friends who weren't around thanks to this war. That's thanks to the Reapers, not you. Are you thinking about anyone in particular? No one I want to talk about right now. I understand. Didn't you have something for me? The Solarian Counselor has an urgent matter. Let me guess. She called the comm room. The Council must be taking the Crucible seriously. I'll see you downstairs.
But if the genophage is gone, what makes these Krogan different from the ones that rebelled? The Krogan have no warships. If the Reapers focus on them, they could be wiped out. Combining their infantry with the Turian fleet is a huge asset, and both parties know it. Are you aware that Clan Erdnot is already petitioning the Council for an embassy and rights to a colony world? The Krogan are coming to the aid of a Council homeworld. That's more than a lot of species can say. I helped them get the genophage cure. Anything more is between the Council and the Krogan. There it is, straight from Commander Shepard. Until tomorrow, this is Diana Allers. Good night and stay strong. Okay, I'll cut that together with the rest of the segment and send it to command for approval. Why are you so interested in my people, Asari? Protheans are always an enigma, a mystery to solve. I wanted to know what happened to your civilization. Commander. You settling in, Javik? I believe some of the crew wishes to be my friend. That is not my purpose here. Also, I find I need to wash my hands. The residue of this ship is strong. How so? I have been exploring. There are traces of those who lived on the Normandy before. I detected a human female. Her genetic structure was unnatural, as if artificially created. Sounds like Miranda. And a drill. There was illness in him. Pain. And a Krogan who lived in these quarters. He was undergoing a metamorphosis. His memories were confused, not organic to his mind. There was great confusion and turmoil. I still can't wrap my head around that. Reading information like you do. For my people, it was as natural as breathing. Evolution's an amazing force. Our scientists believed it was the only force in the galaxy that mattered. They called it the cosmic imperative. The strong flourished. The weak perished. The governments of your cycle seem concerned with ensuring the survival of all. Was this imperative just your scientists' opinion, or did they prove something we don't know? The universe had already proven it. They only had to look around. And saw what, exactly? Extinction is the rule of law in the cosmos. The natural order of things. The weakest species are doomed. It's the duty of the strong to protect the weak. Otherwise, we'd have anarchy. But those who had nothing to offer would be eliminated. So conflict should be a way of life. Evolution demands it. The strong grow stronger by dominating the weak. It is for the greater good of all. Though I do not think your Asari approves of my beliefs. Liara? I think she just had a different idea about what Protheans were like. We are all a product of our time. Had I been born in this cycle, perhaps I would be the noble scholar she wishes me to be. You think you'd like that? It's a whole different line of work. I wouldn't know. Living a life of constant war. Taking life in every battle. I see how it could be tough to see outside the box. It is the only box I have known. It shapes me. As stone is shaped by the one who carves it. This stone has no choice in the form it will take. You and I, Commander. War is our sculptor. And we are prisoners to its design. Maybe not much longer. We win this and we'll both be set free. Busy? I have time if you'd like to talk. In fact, I could use the distraction. What's on your mind? How long it took the Reapers to eradicate the Protheans, and how long they'll need for us. It took them centuries to conquer the Protheans. We're not quite so widespread, but it would still take at least 100 years. It's selfish, but I keep thinking that if we fail, I'm only 109, Shepard. I could live to see the entire cycle come to an end. Only 109, huh? I know. It must seem strange to complain about a thousand-year lifespan. I used to think it was sad that most aliens live such short lives. Maybe it's not such a privilege to outlive so many. To witness so much death. Or you could keep fighting. I know. It's just... difficult. Watching you get shot at out there. We finally have other leaders on our side, but none will take us as far as you can. Sometimes I wonder how you do it. 
Every time the world's about to end. I think about how mad you'd get if I didn't stop it. I don't know if I could do this without you. Flatterer. I try. <laughs> I'll see you soon, Shepard. All right, my turn. What's the first order an Alliance commander gives at the start? <laughs> Never thought I'd see the Krogan and the Turians team up. Even the Reapers have to be a little nervous about pissing them off. I'd say more than a little. I'm sorry about Morden. Had to be done. He'll have a hell of a tombstone. Cured the genophage with a little asterisk and then at the bottom it'll say, which he also created. I always thought he was crazy. Useful, but crazy. Then he gives up his own life. <laughs> to save the Krogan. Doesn't do much to disprove the crazy theory, huh? <laughs> I guess not. But he was one of ours. So now that we got the Krogan and the Turians, what now? The Krogan help us turn the tide on Palavin. They can shoot at something useful for a change. Dig till we hit daylight, huh? It works for me. So how does it feel knowing Krogan will be singing songs about you until the end of time? I'd think it would be an honor. To be honest, I did it so the Krogan would help your people. And believe me, it won't be forgotten. I'm sure it won't. You okay? You don't need to worry. Our fleets will be there for Earth. I'll make sure of it. I know you will. And let's hope Rex keeps running the show on Tachanka. Maybe we should hire a food taster for him. Imagine the carnage if someone like that brother of his Reeve took over. We'll just have to see what happens. I know. It's a chance we have to take, but I have to say, if it wasn't my own world that needed the help, I might have looked for a way out. That would have been tough to live with, tricking an entire species like that. I'm not saying you wouldn't need ice in your veins, but I doubt Morden would have gone along with it.